so. No longer living by the man rules, those full of crap rules, had me at times acting like a damn fool. But now I can stand true and be the man who will be the first example of how my daughters will perceive what a real man should look like, and I won't let them be deceived. Driven by a hundred forms of fear and self-delusion, I was living in a drunken storm of spiritual confusion, choosing to sit in seclusion, abusing my mind and body with alcoholic pollution. But now on the road of recovery, living in the solution, the conclusion is I've healed from self-induced emotional bruising. And as I put the ninth step into practical application, making amends for the past with no procrastination, it feels amazing, something like the weight of boulders falling off of my shoulders. Yes, God gives his hardest battles to his strongest soldiers. So long as I'm sober, I'll keep stepping it up in resiliency as I write these rhymes with impeccable brilliancy and put together pieces of art with symmetrical intricacy, patiently waiting for love and the emotional intimacy, not to mention it's all dependable on the indispensable diligency. I give my recovery as my potential grows infinitely. I've come a far ways from the darkness and pain, but then my heart started to change, departed from rage, departed from shame, so all that remains are the stains of battle scars on my face. So I now choose to change my foolish ways and move further away from the pain of those brutal days, but I wouldn't change my past. It's hard to alter. It all brought me to the man I am today, every mistake and every falter. The serenity I now possess came slow, but at least I'm no longer going to be drowned in stress. I built the strength to allow the steps, guide me in how I will now address the hurt I felt as I continue to progress, as I know God has another plan of achievement plus nothing more, nothing less. How blessed I am to feel the gains as I change and acquire self-discovery. So next is the aim to regain my sanity, be as being insane was the implicit assumption that came with the second step of recovery. So the time has come to strive to be a real man by living in sobriety, so I can be a better father, partner, son, brother, and member of society. <laughs>